Hi, this is Ed from Exotic Blanks. A number of my friends are looking at this and saying, A carbide tool? This can't be the right Ed. But lo and behold, yes, this is going to be a video on a carbide tool. So, what made me do that? Well, first reason was I got into a very hard blank. This is a laminated wood blank, and the laminations are really done well. But that made it very difficult to approach with a skew. So let's do it with the carbide tool. We are using the easy wood tool here, and we'll discuss that as we go along. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoy it. As you can see and hear, this makes the cutting of this blank fairly simple. I'm using the round carbide tool. Uh, they call it the finisher. Uh, they is Easy Wood Tools. Easy Wood Tools has been uh, one of the products that we've been looking at for some time. And honestly, I took, took a while before I would become uh, a proponent of carbide tools. This hard material was one reason. Another reason is they have convinced me to some extent that this is awfully easy. When you use the carbide tool, as long as you keep it level, and there is a level on the, um, on the tool itself so you can watch to make sure that you're keeping it level, uh, pretty much it's very, very easy to do wood turning. So it takes away some of the barriers to entry. Yes, I enjoy using a skew, and no, I'm not going to give up my normal high-speed steel tools. But this makes it simple enough that anybody who really has never done turning before can make a pen fairly easily. And I suppose that there's something good about getting people into it. Once they're into it, we can develop their skills and hopefully get them beyond uh, carbide tools into regular high-speed steel and and using things that we would typically say are turning tools. But this did do an awfully nice job, and it was awfully simple. So there's some advantage to that. As you can see, the results were certainly successful. Thanks for watching. Bye now.